Welcome back to Box Hype. This is Eric, and we've got the BAM box for October 2017. I'm really excited about this one. I've said it before, BAM box is one of the best, if not the best boxes you can get. They've added uh, prop replica items and some really nice autographs. It's, it's the most exciting box you can get right now, I think. And There's always the uh, opportunity to get a one-up, so uh, you never know when you get an extra item or an upgraded item, which just adds to the excitement of opening these boxes. So let's just see what we have in this one. A patch from Fringe. That was a really good show. I enjoyed it, and I only watched about half of the series. I need to finish it. Um, and I think I will now that this brought it back to my attention. I'm kind of getting into these patches now. We get a patch every month along with a pen, and a, yeah, the patch collection is kind of fun. Which brings me to this pen. That looks like Buffy. It is Buffy. And I'm betting this is the common pin because I don't see a one-up card in here anywhere. Uh, we have an art print. Edward Scissorhands. It's a good one. I like that. Number 1075 of 1200. And it's autographed. Who is the artist? Chris Uminga. Very cool. I like it. Okay, wait, this is great. This is from the movie Gremlins, obviously. Uh, signed by the actor Zach Galligan, who uh, played Billy Peltzer in the Gremlins movies. So we have a actual movie actor in a good movie. Great autograph. I like this one a lot. They did good. A replica license plate. Any true fan of horror will recognize this from Evil Dead. If you haven't seen Evil Dead, they're cult classics. They're kind of uh, cheesy, but scary at the same time and just entertaining. You'll love them. I'm saving the prop for last. They always come in these little boxes. Let's see what we have. Oh, this is one of the coolest ones I've seen yet. Check that out. Does that look familiar? If you enjoyed the show Grimm, you know what this is. It's the key. This was a big part near the end of the series. Another one you should go rent or buy and watch the whole series. Uh, Grimm is an awesome show. I'm, I'm sad it ended. If they keep putting things like this in the box, um, really cool replicas, then there's no other box is going to come close to, to what they're delivering uh, in BAM box. There were a couple other pins. Here we are. It looks like Spike from Buffy and who's that really rare one? I don't know who the zombie head looking guy is. He must be from Buffy too, but I don't remember his name. There were a couple of other art prints that were more limited also. Map of the Seven Keys prop from Dark Matter Props. It's that grim prop. That is just so cool. This with the Goonies doubloon. Um, just neat stuff they're, they're putting out. There was a uh, Edward Scissorhands rare print, 250. Didn't get that one, but I like the cartoony one too. It's it's still pretty cool. Oh, and there were a couple of different uh, license plates too. We got the Evil Dead and also the one from Halloween. Awesome. Definitely the winner today, the Grim prop. There's so many great props they could pull from that show. Uh, I'm excited to see what we get next month now. Amazing. All right, it's time to do the value check and see how we did on this box. The fringe patch is going for about $349. The October BAM pin, $1647. The Evil Dead license plate, $986. Map of the Seven Keys from Grimm, $599. Edward Scissorhands print, $2289. The signed Gremlins photo, $2380. 
gives us a total value of $82.50. Cost with shipping is $34.98, which gives us an extra value of $47.52. Let's go save the world.